And the saga continues. Lauren, I hope you got more to say. Oh, the drama continues. Lauren has responded. Well, I hope. I hope she's got something to say this time. So we're gonna go ahead and get straight to it. She titled this video, Stephanie took all the money, shaking my head. You're sad. Oh boy, here we go. Y'all ready? Let's get it. With everything going on, I decided to just get away for Yo, a Yo, let me tell y'all the bullshit that just happened, bro. <laughs> Sorry for the background noise, y'all. I'm outside right now, cause where I was at, it was just playing loud music, but I'm about to go back inside. But I'm so glad I bought this camera, y'all, because, bro, with all of this shit going on, you know what I'm saying? I just went to go on a, I just went on a little trip, you know what I'm saying? Get a breather, get away. So right now I'm in Vegas, y'all. And the shit that just happened is crazy, bro. Like, y'all be let trying to make it. Just from the title alone, let me guess. You went to Vegas to spend some money, <laughs> to gamble a little bit, to get away from Steph. And Steph cleared up all the bank accounts. Is that what happened? What happened? Let me know. Like, Steph is a saint, bro. And she's not. She's not. I'm about to tell y'all what just happened, bro. I'm so glad that I bought this camera so y'all can see. Cause bro, I'm just on the side because now I gotta walk back through the hotel, but but the music is just so loud. I'm gonna go back to my room and sit down and talk about this shit because. Like y'all, look where I'm at, bro. As soon as I get away, you know what I'm saying? Get a little breather, some more bullshit happens, bro. But I'm about to break this shit down for y'all. All right, so like I was saying, y'all, I came out here to get <laughs> what? a breather. What just happened? She just showed us a parking lot or what the fuck was that a building yo we believe you okay you say you're in vegas you in vegas it is what it is who cares where you're at what happened you know what i'm saying and it's like i can't even do that bro because like one all the videos i feel like most of y'all is like signing with stuff which is cool like you know what i'm saying i'm not <laughs> going like whatever y'all gonna have your opinions on sh i'm in neither side the reason why it seems like a lot of people are on steph's side is because bitch you ain't talking all you're saying in your responses is i'm single that's not enough you're not giving us enough information we want to know your side but you're not giving it it's on shit like you know what i'm saying but at the same time it's like like you also had to see it from two perspectives you know what i'm saying and a lot of y'all is like think steph is some sort of saint like you know what i'm saying ain't nobody I'm said bad that person and all of this shit but y'all don't be like y'all don't be really seeing what what happens you feel me like and steph be doing shit too like she's not a saint <laughs> like y'all think she is you know what i'm saying so boom i'm out here or whatever and literally bro soon as i leave like what happened? same day why did she clear the bank account bro like, is you, like, bro. All right, so, boom. Go, go on there to check, check everything and shit. And why is the shit gone? <laughs> like, bro, like, we Our had a joint expression. account. You know what I'm saying? And then we have our own personal accounts. So, obviously, the joint account holds majority of money. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Because it was just everything. Like that type of shit bothers me. People think just because you're married... You have to have a joint account. Why? Why? I know people use joint accounts to pay the, the mutual bills that people have together. But you guys, simple shit. When someone gets mad, they'll wipe that shit out. And you're, you are left with nothing. Nothing. So why do all that? Have your separate accounts. And whenever it's time to pay the bills, y'all put in your percentages. That's it. And y'all two weren't even married, Lauren and Steph. The fuck? Just because y'all got a kid together don't mean shit. Y'all got to stop doing that. Those, those joint accounts are trouble. You know what I'm saying? Within those years, a whole majority of the money. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, we have our own personal money. But the joint account is the big account. You know what I'm saying? So, mind you, the account is set up to where... And this where, this where I probably fucked up. I'm not on cap, but I'm not thinking she ever going to do some shit like this. So the account is set up to where anybody can, me or her, can go 
withdraw any amount of money like and you don't need the other person's right. like, permission to do so you know what i'm saying i think you can set it to where you can do that but you know what i'm saying when if when we first made it we made it so that we each could do it not thinking that this shit would ever happen so mistake number even one then, even then even with all this shit going on i'm still not thinking she would do some shit like that there's a whole joint account under that account there's four accounts there's more bad breakups than good more bad divorces than good. It doesn't matter how well you know your partner, how much you trust your partner. When shit goes south and it goes sour, people change, okay? They change for the worst. So the person you thought you knew no longer exists because now they're bitter, now they're angry, now they're upset, now they're hurt, especially if you did them dirty. Now you're gonna see a side of them you've never seen. And then shit like this happens, wiping the accounts. And it had everything to do with our business over the years and journey. So you, I, we had a regular checking account. We had a tax account. We had journeys account. And then we had a savings account. The savings account hold all the money. Our checkings account, we really never we really never kept a lot of money in there because, you know what I'm saying, with debit cards and stuff, we was like, you know, if anything ever get hacked or anything, you know what I'm saying, they really, they like, if they do get it, they're not going to get much. Like, you know what I'm saying? So we usually just transfer from, like, if we're using money on that joint, we usually... Are y'all confused right now? Because all of a sudden, this bitch got a lot to say. <laughs> when it had to do with her money, she's got so much to say. This is the most I've heard from her in this whole situation. Have you guys ever heard that saying? You can fuck with me all you want, but don't fuck with my money. This is what's happening. Transfer money from the savings to the checking. If that makes sense, you that's touched just a how, soft, you know what I'm saying, it works. A soft spot. And then, but yeah, y'all, so she took the money that was in the savings. Of course, she wasn't going to touch Journey's account. You know what I'm saying? Of course, she wasn't going to do that. Journey has a, a certain amount of money that we always add money to. So she's straight for the future. But it's like, why would you do that, bro? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that shit just... I don't know, bro. But like I said, like y'all be making it seem like she don't do nothing, bro. And I'm glad I bought this camera so I can show y'all this some bullshit. And y'all know it. So now <laughs> I got to figure out this shit. Now, like, is this about to be a whole thing? Because it's just like, why would you do that? I would not do you like that. You want to put out a video and you want to say, Lauren, you're a narcissist and all that. Like, all right, cool. Now I'm going to do a video and I'm expose, I'm going to expose what you really be doing. <laughs> like, this shit right here, you uh... know it is 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 overboard bro like you know what i'm saying like i did my shit don't get me wrong don't get me this fake ass drama let me tell you the difference between this and easy and natalie it was easy to tell with easy and natalie how fake that was this i needed more time and i'm thinking it's because i just started reacting to them so i've been i haven't been watching their channel in a good year or two so i, I so i missed a lot so me jumping into the drama right away i'm still trying to fill this whole situation out and in my opinion, it's fake. But because a little percent of me, I would say mm, 10%, is still a little doubtful, like this might be real, that's why I keep reacting. But as soon as I find out that this shit's fake, <laughs> I ain't doing it. But let's let's pretend this is real, okay? Oh, but don't sit here and act like we ain't both work for that shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like. I just don't think that's fair. I don't know, y'all. I'm really trying not to stress this shit so much, but it's like, damn, like, soon as I leave, like, okay, so if I ain't leave, would you have done it? Y'all gonna think at the end of the day what y'all want about me, like, you know what I'm saying? That's cool. Like, I'm not even tripping on it for real. Like, y'all gonna take y'all sides. That's just how the internet is. Y'all gonna take sides, you know what I'm saying? But also, don't be blind to the fact that Steph ain't no saint, bro. She not no angel that just don't do nothing and got hurt in the press. Like, no, that's not what it is. This right here proves it, bro. Like, everything aside, like, I, I, I wouldn't even do that to you. You feel me? Like, I just feel like now she just trying to hit, hit where she know it's going to hurt, which, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's not even the fact that the money going, like I said, because money going to always come back around. It ain't like I don't got my own money. You feel me? I'm cool regardless. But it's just it's just a principle of like, damn, like, we both did that shit. You feel me? If you was going to take any sort of money from that shit, that shit, you should have took half of it. Or you know what? I'm a really generous person, so I probably would have even gave you 60, 70% of it. You know what I'm saying? Because I know how I am. Like, I'm At this point, while she's rambling, I'm looking in the background, trying to find some shoes, trying to find a sweater or two. I'm trying to see if Lauren's there with her. 
Is she hiding in that bathroom? You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm always making shit move. Probably would have even let you take some of what was supposed to be mine. I'm gonna just try not to stress about this shit so much cause like damn, like fuck it. I'm in Vegas, you know what I'm saying? Might fuck around, go downstairs, and you know what I'm saying? All this bullshit happen. Honestly, it gotta be some type of luck coming my way. So honestly, I'm probably about to just go downstairs, you know what I'm saying, hit the casino and you know what I'm saying, release some of this some of this stress because this shit right here, like this is not what I wanna be dealing with while I'm out here. And it's just like, why would you do that? Y'all gonna believe what y'all want. Y'all can come for me. Y'all can think I'm this. Y'all can think I'm that. But at the end of the day, don't don't think Steph is a saint because she not. And I'm going to keep saying that in this video. <laughs> I'm going to keep saying that because this shit right here just proved a lot to me, bro. Just proved a lot to me. You already proven shit to me in the past. See, it's weird. Both of them are trying to convince us of how bad the other person is. Like, who cares? Who gives a fuck? We don't know you, you don't know us. So who is it that you're trying to prove yourself to? You get what I'm saying? They're trying too hard. But now this, you know what I'm saying? It's just like certain shit, you know, like, you know, like I said, I would never do it, me personally. Y'all gonna have y'all opinions on the shit? Shit, some of y'all might even still, still think that this is okay. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I just don't think that's something you should do if you both work for it. Like, I would never sit here and take for That's like basically damn near stealing from somebody. I would never go take that, something that someone else worked for as well. You know what I'm saying? But honestly, I ain't even going to ramble about this shit for much longer. Like, I'm really about to just go enjoy myself at this point because <laughs> this shit right here is just crazy. So, I'm going to just go ahead and end this video right here. And, yeah, like, I'm just... With this shit. Isn't it funny how they can do an eight minute video and get thousands upon thousands of views and make money off this shit? That's all they gotta do is like in the middle of gambling, they go to their room, do sit down, talk for eight minutes, publish that shit, go back to gambling. They just made money. Hey, that's how it works. They created a following and they got plenty of people to watch. And here I am reacting. <laughs> Alright y'all, stay tuned for the next reaction. If you haven't already, subscribe and share my channel. See y'all in the next video. Peace.